Hello, if you're in the software development industry and looking for a better organization of your work, keep watching, this video is for you. Meet Frank, he's a project manager in a software company. As you know, IT projects often feel confusing, but fortunately, there are repeatable patterns in how we move tasks forward. They're called workflows and we've built a whole software around it. PlayKey is a project management platform and we'll show you how it can help you systemize chaotic work situations into easy to follow processes. In order to map out your processes, you need to understand what are the start and end points of your project. Take Frank for example. The start point of his project is when a request for a solution is received from a client with the product objectives and the end point are the software deliverables. He also needs to define what actions are being taken in between, by whom and in which time frame. After the research phase, the design process begins. With this process completed, they proceed in creating a back-end solution to support the front-end design. Once the product is developed and launched, the iterative cycle of testing becomes imperative. He translates this process into a single place using boards, tasks and columns which are the building blocks in PlayKey. There are two ways to start using these blocks. Let's go through them in PlayKey. One is by choosing existing templates ready-made to suit different industries. Go to Create from Templates and pick the one that's best for you and your team. In the Software Development category, you have three of the most popular templates, Product Roadmap, Bug Tracking and Product Launch. Building blocks here are predefined by the most common scenarios in the specific area, but you can edit them later to fit your particular needs. The second option is to create a board from scratch. Let's see how it goes. You always start with the board, serving as the heart of the project. Frank names his board after the working title of the product. Then you continue by creating tasks that need to be completed, paying special attention in how you formulate them. We want them to be as actionable as possible so everyone knows what needs to be done. For example, recreate inbox notifications instead of just notifications is a much clearer and easy to follow task. Then we classify tasks into groups. They represent the movement of the tasks. In Frank's case, work flows linearly like a checklist, completing tasks that are independent and eventually lead to the project completion. He organizes groups in five different categories. After determining the movement of his work, Frank starts categorizing it by adding columns to the tasks is how he controls who is responsible for what and by when. You assign each task to a team member. You assign it in order of urgency and importance. For precise directions, create a description column, a date column for a deadline, and tags to determine the department or type of issue. You can also choose a number, a rich text or a link column to plan and monitor the delivery of the project in an even more organized way. When the structure is defined, you have the option to turn this workflow into a template so other colleagues from your company can use it for similar projects. What's probably most valuable is the choice to stay on track by monitoring the big picture as well as the details of all activities on board and in items. For a better visualization, choose Kanban view and filter the board by status for an easy access of data. Drag and drop items and move tasks till the final stage. As a manager, one can filter the board by urgency and control the priority of tasks, while each employee can filter the board by person, choose themselves and save the view so as to access personal tasks instantly. You can also sort the information on board by importance, creation date, price or other column values. For a detailed history of what happens within a board, turn to the activity log and see time and author of change, name of the board, view, column, group or item to which the change was made as well as previous and new values. 
The whole time during your project, you collaborate with teammates straight in the item card where you can mention a person or a team to get their attention, or simply give feedback to a proposal or an answer to a comment or a question. Keep everything in one place. Share files by attaching documents and links in the card and make them accessible to everyone at any time. For each of these actions, you'll receive a bell or email notification which helps you stay in context and never miss a deadline. This is how Frank, as well as you, can keep everyone aligned and ensure products are successfully launched and clients are satisfied. Projects are alike, but teams are different. Your team might not use a template or the exact same workflow as Frank, but it is definite that every software development team can benefit from more clarity, coordination and collaboration at work, offered at every step of the way in Plakey.